Hi and welcome. My name is Joa and we're playing Light Matter. Okay, we are here. I don't know why, but the game saved not in this place. I need to uh, restart the previous puzzle, replay it. Uh, you know, there's a great elevators in here. Yeah. You have some problems with elevators. Yeah, I know. Listen. I'll uh, I'll think of something. Yeah, yeah. Start heading back. I'll tell you when to stop. Perfect. Perfect idea, you know? Uh, maybe you can Okay. It's worse than I thought. Arthur is trying to sabotage light matter. What? It's not just poisonings. I found the schematics for his experiment on the core. He's not trying to improve it. He's trying to overload it. No. If he manages to do that, we are all going to die. I am not going to let Arthur ruin our future. I have to get to Virgil. Arthur is after me. Whoever finds this, if it's not too late, tell Virgil that Arthur needs to be stopped. Okay. You say so. Um Arthur. Is this is Arthur? We the one who are we talking to? Uh, wait, what? Okay. Thank you. Uh, so, what am I talking about? Oh, thanks. Thank goodness. Um, yeah, I forget because of her. Oh, wait, I'm going back. Okay, let's go. I don't think that you know the door is open, so let's go. All right, now pay close attention to what. Of course. That elevator was your quickest way out. You but think? Yeah, and an it was I who broke it. Yes. You are going to be my assistant. Oh no. Try to contain yourself. You will be moving deeper into the facility through our research and development department. Before I allow you in, I would like to make something abundantly clear. Now what? Be careful with what you touch. Of course. Uh, if you didn't see, I don't have Tell one. More about the plan as I work out the details. Do not make me regret this, and remember to do exactly as I say. I think that they, these guys, uh, cut budgets of on their left, because every one of them is not safe. Oh, Nikola Tesla again, and uh, Albert Einstein. Okay, so, we're going here. This is where we develop our Don't call me like that, please. Everything you see here is confidential, expensive, and fragile. Of course. Don't treat it like you treat my elevators or bridges. Oh, of course. So now, what? What? Where is this cat? Can I open it? No. Where is the cat? Give me a cat. I know it somewhere nearby. 
These doors are locked. Let's go. So far we didn't Behold, solve any puzzles. Ooh. Uh, and what do you uh, want? A beam of light so magnificent, it almost looks like matter being created before you. Oh, so it will... Uh, yeah, okay. When I will be a dangerously too far, it will be red. That's good. What's this? Nope. Okay, thanks. Let's go. Mm -hmm. And I, of course, cannot jump with it. What? Yeah. Yeah, I'm a little bit not good with it. Okay, sorry. Again. Almost drowned in darkness. Fascinating, isn't it? The connectors suspend uh, photon crystals not so. from electromagnets. As long as they're in line of sight to what I call a mother source, they create a powerful beam of light matter. A beam so powerful that it produces a surplus of energy. Although the connectors are just prototypes for the core, they display the very essence of light matter. Okay, thanks, thanks. I appreciate your concerns. Oh, there is another one. Whoa! What are you doing? So I need a lamp. Go there. Oh, or no, not. Without the technology behind the connectors, photon crystals would be no better than diamonds. What's happened? Devoid of function. The crystals possess great power, but it's my technology that releases and tames that power. And why do I need it? I mean, there is no way to take it with me somewhere. Right? So why do I need it? Ah, so to go here. Okay, thanks. Thank you guys, you're the best. But I need to leave you here. Hmm. Can I go up? No, that's the answer. Perfect. That's just perfect. Light matter broke. Really? Why? <sighs> That's interesting. That's very interesting. Let's go and try again. Oh, perfect. Why is this happened to me right now? Continue. I I hope that I don't need to re. Nope. Nope. Assistant, I yep. think a lot about the future. In these labs, I've spent years testing the prototypes under various conditions, all to ensure the success of the core. You see, although the photon connectors have a 100.2% conversion efficiency, I've reached 107% with the core. 
I achieved critical mass. <laughs> and Arthur wanted to stop yeah. the prototype. Mass. You're great. He was so certain that the laws of physics were unbreakable. That is where we differed. Where he saw laws, I saw suggestions. Oh, now I understand. Why well, need to place it there? Um... But I cannot go back like this. Nope. There's no chance. So... I really don't understand. Still don't understand. What am I supposed to do with one of them? Maybe I need to place it here? Nope. Oh, I can place it here. Yes. That's the answer. Where, where am I going? Did anyone understand where am I going? Because I'm not. Okay. You go here. And we are going the another the other way. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, I knew I am the best. So, can I take this one with me? Yes! That's great. And you're going with me. In that tunnel, we expose the photon connectors to wind, water and hail. These tests ensure that the core, no matter the weather, will survive. You are no crystal, but you should be able to handle a couple of rounds through it. Okay. Thanks. Excellent! You have overcome an obstacle and been baptized in the waters of light matter. I Thank you. I can almost imagine the stench of journalist fading away. Nope. That's too early to think about it. Okay, now I'm really afraid any shadow that makes... Oh, it's really creepy. Everyone disappears in here. Ah, the core. No matter oh, how many no. times we see it, it leaves us in awe, doesn't it, assistant? This is everything Light Matter Technologies has built towards. Every power cell, every connector, all of them combine to create this. This? By using photon power cells to collect the energy from a large-scale beam of light matter, I built a perpetual motion machine. Facts are facts. The energy is clean, infinite, and is about to usher in the next scientific revolution. Um, I'm not so sure about it. I think that you're... A little bit delusional. Uh, wait, what? Okay, let's go back.
if I'm doing it right. Let's go there. Um, nope. That was wrong. I think that I need to leave it there. Nope. There's no way that they can leave through it. Now, you probably have your own ideas about the applications of light matter, but there's no need to write them down. We have given a small scale prototype to a test town of 500 inhabitants. For the first time, these townspeople have access to a steady cool. energy source. They are now thriving. Now we have it here. Yeah, we can go anywhere, almost. Oh, I can go inside. There's no, uh, really no need to do it. Hey, don't do this, please. And we're going in here. Assistant, I now have the plan. To get you out, we are shutting down the core. When I what? Since I'm limited by my body, but not my mind, I wasn't able to get around the obstacles. As you have the opposite problem, you'll play a part in this. The core is very delicate, so I'll be up here in my control room managing the shutdown. As my assistant, you'll be the one pulling the lever. Hmm. Wait, what? When I told James of okay. this plan, <laughs> he seemed jealous. He's the Arthur, right? It's him who did everything in here. Wait, what? What's happening? Maybe I need to place it here. inside an office space. Well, morale was low because of the rampant hair loss. So I implemented a photon fun hour. During their breaks, employees were allowed to play with the connectors. Productivity okay. rose by 12%. Cool, now we are here. And what? I think you can make it like this, if I need it, I don't know. Okay, nope. So I need this second one to take with me. I think. At least. Yes. Yes, and let's go. Like this, and you are going with me. So, That's James interesting. Just me. He's worried that since you've been weightlifting pens all your life, you have too frail a constitution to pull a lever. Let's see if he's right. Ah, oh, why you? I'm not your guinea pig. You know that, Assistant, right? Assistant, you need to know what will happen after the temporary shutdown. Once the core is off, the quakes and shadow anomalies will subside, allowing you to walk your fragile little head out of here. But more importantly, observing the shutdown will provide me the information I need to fix the side effects permanently. The core uh, will repower and it will shine eternally. Oh. Really? I can take him with me. Uh, wait, what? He said shut permanently? Uh, really? 
he said something like that? Do you want to hear a secret? Aperture Science has an artificial intelligence prototype. They tested it by having it create the perfect cake recipe. It succeeded. But the first iterations of that recipe used neurotoxin as the primary ingredient. As a human being, I'm worried. Okay. I'm worried, of course. Now we have both of them. Let's go back here. Hey guys, I need you in here. So jump up. Yeah, yeah, they drink too much. They need my help. Okay. Wait, why is not working? This mineral inspection chamber makes me nostalgic. Before really? I discovered this mountain, Arthur had a mineral collection. He called me over one day to show off a particularly rare example he had found, a photon crystal. I could see the potential immediately. <laughs> and Arthur thought it was just a rare crystal. I thought he was brain damaged. How? Yeah, you're a great friend. Yeah, I think you're the best one. Oh, nice music. I cannot change the station. Ignore that sign. As I've told you before, all groundbreaking technology has its kinks. Oh, perfect. And that's what I wanted in here. Okay. Oh. That's interesting. But I don't like it. Impressive. With that agility and complete disregard for your own safety, one could easily mistake you for a cat. I like cats. Yeah, yeah. I knew. Feel like a cat. Okay, I need this thing here. Maybe. Cool. Let's see what do we have in here. Nothing. Uh, so I cannot jump, so there's no need for me to take this one with me. But yeah, let's go here. Hmm, wait, what? How does it work? I cannot take it with me. What do you want from me? This door is closed. Hello? How do you understand that? Where am I supposed to go? There is a darkness. Hmm, that's very curious. You know, assisting me with the call. 
will be the single most important thing you will ever do in your life. Yeah, yeah. Around the world, hundreds of millions of people aren't connected to the power grid. We think ourselves so enlightened, but we are surrounded by a sea of darkness. To bring light, sacrifices must be made by all of us. What will happen if I do it like this? Oh. Nice. Now that's interesting. Look at the plants around you, assistant. We planted them yesterday. You see, light matter accelerates photosynthesis and makes them grow at an incredible rate. Finally. Imagine applying this technology to cultivation throughout the world. Famine, mass deforestation, floods, all of these relegated to history. Light matter will not only brighten the world, it will give life. Nope. That was a bad idea. Very bad idea. Um, what am I supposed to do? Okay. Now I'm back. I'm confused. I'm... Oh. Not so confused of the role, huh? Nothing can stop these plants while they're exposed to light. <sighs> yeah, Understand? nothing. The accelerated photosynthesis also allows them to regrow lost stems in a matter of minutes. It sparks the imagination, doesn't it? My engineers are already trying to grow back my leg. Really? With light? Or what? Or how? That doesn't make sense. Or this light matter gives them uh, a needed fuel to make it. Or something like this. I don't understand that at all. Okay. So now I need to take it back with me. Okay. Close it. Interesting. Let's go. You are going with me. Oh. Okay. I know what why they Assistant. make this stairs right there. Of so course. it's about time you learn how Arthur almost destroyed it. Three months and a lot of hair ago, Arthur went to the board of <laughs> and a lot of hair ago. Back. He proved to them that light matter was causing minor side effects. It was humiliating, but I solved the problem by installing the decontaminators. That is when Arthur started poisoning people. Oh. Later, that vermin of a man had the nerve oh, yeah, to use that Virgil. as further proof to the board. While we were investigating the matter, one of my employees discovered his plan to overload the core and destroy the entire facility. Luckily, 
James and I stopped him before it was too late. Arthur paid for what he did, but nothing can redeem betrayal. Of course. Nothing can. Uh wait what? Is there a way I need to go? Nope. Let's change it. Oh. Cool. Now we're going here. Cool. And uh, how am I supposed to go there? That's what is oh, now I understand. No, I need to place it on the end of uh. This one? Yes. Here. Let me explain what betrayal is. In the mountain, before this facility, Wait. Arthur and I would work together weeks on end to finish no. the first photon connections. Come back. All those cold, dark nights. And suddenly, breakthrough. A web of light surrounded us. It was Ooh, us. mesmerizing. Uh-huh. Go there. Okay. At least it's almost there. Cool. Jump. Woo. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Right, You're getting close to the core, but the quakes are getting. What? What? <laughs> yes, James. <laughs> yes, James. James, you have brawn, not brains. My new assistant and I have the situation under control. <laughs> Made your assistant. Keep everyone safe. Goodbye. Uh, I was raised. Persistent, replaceable, and silent. Oh, really? That's what you like in people. In assistance, okay. There's no people for you, right? Only the, those who can be useful for you. Oh, oh, cool. I hope that it will not break on its way. Thank you. Of course. Uh, you need to handle bridges with more finesse, assistant. Of course. That was my mistake. Of course. What was that? Oh. Ooh. Ellen here. Talk with me, Ellen. I'm having these intense flooding headaches. They only seem to go away when I stare directly into light. And I'm not the only one. We're all slowly turning into mobs. Staring at lamps for hours on end. Not only that, people are 
still losing hair and now fingernails. It doesn't make any sense. It's been weeks since Virgil and James handled Arthur. And still things are getting worse. I don't care what Virgil says. The decontaminators are clearly not working. And just handing us wigs isn't helping. I need to figure out exactly what Arthur was doing and why. You think you need that to know? Okay, we are here. Okay, now we are going wait, back. Yeah, I think we're going back. Come with me. Let's go. Okay, and uh, how is it exactly will work? I don't really understand where I need to go. Wait, what? Why do I come here? That was definitely not the right way to do it. Definitely. I needed it to be here, not there. Here. You go in here. And you are going with me. Now, so there's not only Arthur that doing this to them. There's something more. Someone more to blame. Let's hear it. Okay, Ellen. Okay. So, Arthur was the one who, not the one who did it. After all, oh, that's what happened. So, it's one of them. Virgil or James? Some one of them are, and of course Virgil. I knew it from the beginning. There's no way that the guy with this... And I think that he purposely made me go this way. He knew that everything is broken. Yeah, I, that's definitely it. Okay, I think I'll end it here. I hope you enjoyed. Smash like if you did. Leave your comments and subscribe. See you in the next videos. Bye!